there could be any number of reasons for needing to restore a wallet, from failure of hardware to simply forgetting your passphrase. What you may want to do when you create a wallet is immediately delete it and use your backup to restore it. For the purpose of this video, I am going to restore a wallet that I have forgotten the passphrase to, this wallet here. Click on Import or Restore Wallet. Now choose what backup you are going to restore from, single sheet paper, fragmented, or digital. We will cover watching only wallets in another video. You can also test if a backup is valid by checking this box. I have a single sheet backup, so I will select this option and click on Continue. Now you need to enter the information that is on the paper backup. You can just key it in. However, what I did was scan the QR code on the paper backup to get a text version, just to make it easier for this demonstration. Remember, if anyone has the code, they effectively have your wallet and its contents. I will just copy the root key into the fields. If I had a secure print copy, I would have to enter the additional code written on the backup. The order of the information is important, so the lines need to be entered into the correct rows. Leave the encrypted wallet checked as this means you will have your wallet protected by a passphrase. Now click Restore Wallet. This wallet already exists in my armory. However, I have forgotten the passphrase, so I will choose the second option and merge them which will allow me to add a new passphrase. This is where I tell myself to remember this one. And now I get to remember it again. Note that we are creating this from a paper backup, so we don't need to make another one. Click Accept, and then the wallet will be restored in its encrypted state, meaning I must remember the passphrase. Click Yes to rescan. It may take a little while, but not always. This message means I am back in operation again with a wallet I can now get into.